Hi, Jay Silver with Helicon, and today we're out on a compaction grouting site. You may recognize the site, possibly coming here as a kid or with your kids. This is Malibu here in Tampa Bay, and the project's in collaboration with Tremel Crow. They're building an apartment complex called Allura. And what they found uh, throughout the site in three different zones, this zone in particular was sinkhole, loose, sandy soils. And they want to be able to build upon this and make sure that those new beautiful apartment complexes don't settle. And what we're doing to prevent that, as you see the trucks arriving with the mud, CMEX, we're pumping uh, grout, uh, concrete under high pressure through all of these grout points. There's about 46 of these on the site, ranging from 40 feet all the way down to 60 feet. And those are going down to a hard load-bearing strata, possibly bedrock limestone. We're gonna cap that limestone layer and pump the material upward staging until we either get high pressure, and we can show you on the, the valve over here, a high pressure reading, or we get heave of the ground. That tells us we pumped enough material into that zone to remediate, unpack, fill any voids, and we do that process all the way up uh, to, to about 10 feet to the surface. And what that's gonna do, the big benefit, is the load-bearing capacity is gonna be strengthened of the ground, and it's gonna protect the new apartments that are gonna go on this site so they don't settle after they're built, which could be much, much higher, uh, astronomically higher cost to repair them once the buildings are in place versus us addressing it here now. Again, we got CMEX over here, starting to pour mud down into the pump and that's gonna pump down along the line. Here's our high pressure reading that our operator is gonna be watching. If you wanna come around here and kinda of just, and he's looking for a certain pressure reading on the gauge, which is gonna tell him that that zone has been properly compacted and filled, and then he can tell his, his team, pull this up with these hydraulic rams. It's gonna pull this pipe up to the next soil zone, and then we can also break off pipe as we're pulling that up and extracting it. Um, another indicator besides the high pressure, the operator is gonna be watching. Um, this is our, our ground indicator, and he's gonna be watching this with a sight level, and he's gonna be watching this for any movement. So once this ground heaves up, we know that we've pumped enough material under the ground and compacted it, and we can go up to the next soil zone. And I'm out here with uh, Ed Liddy, one of our foremen, who's uh, the, the head man on the site. And uh, Ed, what are we, uh, how many zones are we doing out here? How many points, uh, they what's have, the depths, kind of those things? They have three different zones out here. The okay. depths range from 40 to 60 feet, and we'll be compaction grouting on all three zones. Yeah, thank you, Ed. And um, it, Ed was telling me the project's gonna take us about two weeks uh, to complete. There's about 46 points, as Ed mentioned, ranging from about 40 feet all the way down to 60 feet. And in these three zones, here's one that was standing behind us. They found sinkhole or void real loose soils, and they wanted to go ahead and treat those soils now before they put these apartment complexes in. So they're on stable ground and have a solid foundation. So as I was mentioning, we're doing three zones on this site. Uh, the engineers tested uh, we're in this zone right now, zone one. The drill rig, actually, when they were testing, sunk down and had to be pulled out by one of the dozers. And then we have zone two and also zone three. And that gives us our 46 grout points. And all of these are going between 40 and 60 feet down in depth. And this project, these three zones, will take us approximately about two weeks uh, to pump and remediate all the soil zones. And once we're done, the client is gonna have a firm, solid foundation for their new apartment complex and buildings to rest upon. And they can have the peace of mind that they're not gonna settle down the road. If you're a builder, GC, or developer that's found potential sinkhole conditions, loose sandy soils on your building site, and you'd like to know the best value engineered solution to stabilizing those soils, Reach out to Helicon and let us be your trusted advisor so we can work together for the best option for your building site.